Hi everyone, it's me. I wanted to talk about set. And this kind of set we're referring to is, it's, it's a lot of people say set in stone, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a referral a little bit more wide, wide uh, more at a wider <laughs> point of view, etc. But if you look at different substances which set, you, and I'm just gonna use two. So one is jello and one is concrete. Jello, when you pour it, you know, you, you put the jello subs, the jello packet in a bowl, you boil the water, you pour the water in, it dissolves, you put it in the refrigerator and it's set. It's, it says it's ready when it's set. You just, I don't know how long it takes. Some set sooner than others, but for the most part, jello is set. But when you take it out, you can shake it around and it kind of moves or flows or looks, you know, whatever. And then you scoop it up and you jiggle it on your plate and then you put it in the hatch and then it melts and then it goes down the hatch and, and that's it. But what happens when you pour concrete and it's set, it's solid. Normally it's set for it's however long until maybe tree roots gonna get underneath it and break it up and you have to reset it or cut it off, whatever. But for the most part, um, concrete is solid and it's set and it's, it's good to go. I just want to talk about, in my life, <laughs> regarding relationships. I have been both set like jello and set like concrete. The set like concrete people in my life are people that are solid, trustworthy, um, are unbreakable. They, I know they have my back. They are simply solid, good, and they're not going anywhere. And the set in jello for me <laughs> has to do with people I have to be a little bit more flexible with. People that may come and go, may flow in and out of your life. Um, it, it, it also, for me, refers to how set I am as a person when it comes to my feelings, my emotions, my thoughts, etc. Th some things I'm set in stone regarding, which is respect, kindness, loyalty, um, being with someone who is faithful. There's certain things I'm set on. And I know I'm good for it. I know what I'm good for, what I'm asking for. So I'm pretty set in stone regarding some of my, most of my beliefs, thoughts, and feelings, and worldviews. But when it comes to jello, and it ca ca talk about something that's set and it's flexible, uh, certain things I'm flexible about are when I meet someone and I give them a chance and we get to know each other. Well, I'm flexible with them because I believe everyone you cross paths with, with brings something else to the table that I am supposed to learn. Whether I'm supposed to learn a new fact, I learn to be a little bit more patient, maybe a little bit more kind, maybe a little bit more understanding. Um, I was walking around the park the other day and my life for the most part is quiet. And my friend and I, we were walking with our dogs and another girl came up with a baby and she clearly was struggling with either postpartum depression or something else um, along those lines. So she, um, it was, it, it was really um, kind of like a situation where normally one would become a little bit frustrated, but in that situation to be flexible like Jello, to give this person the time of day to just be kind in that moment. That's the kind of thing I'm talking about, not to be completely set in stone regarding how you feel across the board, because once in a while we have to be a little bit more like Jello. <laughs> and that's just the way it is. I shouldn't say we, it should, I should just say I. So that's what I wanted to talk about. Are you more like Jello or are you more like concrete? For me, I have a combination of both. And I think people who are set in concrete and they're unwavering and they're difficult and whatever they say is truth. I can't imagine how challenging my life would be if I was not willing to learn from other people and, and take out new information or have a new thought or idea be brought to the table for me. I don't know, it's just the way it is for me. So that's what I wanted to talk about. I hope my words inspire you. I, 
I, I just had a thought about being set today and I thought the jello versus concrete theory was pretty good. So anyways, think about it. I'll be back and we'll talk soon. Bye-bye.